Has this happened to you? You bought some batteries about a month or two back, you used them a couple of times, all of a sudden you go to charge the batteries and you hear this. What does that mean? It's telling you you have a bad battery. Don't throw these away whatever you do. Let me show you how you can easily fix this. Hi you guys, welcome back. And if you're new to my channel, I would like to take the time out to say welcome and hope to see you again and again. Well, if you're like me, you probably buy a lot of AA batteries. I was buying tons of these batteries. I got tired of buying them, so what I did is I bought, they say you can get 1500 chargers out of these batteries and one charge will last you up to a year, as you can see on the chart here. These things aren't cheap. For four of them, they run anywhere from 10 to $20 for four. So shop around when you're trying to find these batteries because the prices can be crazy if you don't shop around. Anyway, one day I was recharging two of my batteries and all of a sudden this happened. Well, it took me a little while to figure out that one of the batteries is dead and it won't charge anymore. Well, I would get upset because I just bought these batteries maybe a month or two and now they're telling me that it's a dead battery. So what I would do is toss this battery away and replace it. But then I found out this little trick that not too many people know. So watch this. Well, the first thing you want to do is get your multimeter out and determine which battery is the dead battery. Now, if the battery is completely dead, you're not going to get a reading. So put the multimeter on the uh, two volt area here. And then take the battery and put a probe on each end and see what the reading is. Looks like we have 0.68 volts. So this is the bad one. These batteries are supposed to be 1.5 volts. Okay, let's check the other battery. This one should be somewhat fully charged, at least 95% charged. Okay, it looks like we're getting 1.43, close enough. Now that we know which battery is bad, what we're gonna do is get some wire. I have a piece of extension wire here that I cut off. You wanna strip both ends like the way it's shown here. Next, you're gonna need two fully charged batteries. Next, you're gonna take the two fully charged batteries and you're going to connect them together like you would if you were to put them in a flashlight. You're going to take one wire and connect it to the negative side of the battery. You're going to take the other wire and connect it to the positive side of the battery. Now they make a little tray that you could do this, but since I don't have a tray, I'm going to use electrical tape. As you're applying the tape on, stretch the tape so the wire is tightly on against the negative side and or the positive side as you do this. As you're applying the tape, just stretch it so everything fits nice and tight. Now using the same method, we're going to do that by tying the two batteries together. Again, when putting them together, stretch the tape so it fits taut together. Okay, see how easy that was? Okay, now we're gonna move the multimeter to the position of 20 volts. Now we should have, or approximately, 
three volts coming out of the wires here. What you're going to do is take the dead battery, you're going to take the two wires and touch the battery on each end. Make sure you connect positive to positive and negative to negative. And you're going to touch it for a second or two. You're going to do this two to three times really quick as shown. Once you've done that, let's put it in the charger and see now if it wants to charge. Awesome. Now it's charging like it's supposed to. Man, I could kick myself for all the times that I was throwing these batteries away thinking that they were dead and they couldn't be recharged anymore. Well, now you know how to resurrect these batteries. Okay, well I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it was very informative. Please check out my other how-to videos. Oh, and check out my new website. There's new items being put in there every day. Don't forget to like and subscribe and of course hit the bell. Until then, we'll see you at my next video. Bye!